Hi everyone, today I'm going to tell you how to write uh, your first program in Python and where you are going to use the IDE of spider uh, which is uh, under um, Python and also the command prompt to run our program and it is going to be a series of videos where I'm going to teach you Python and we'll write various programs using Python. Um, now first of all, uh, basically uh, what is Anaconda in Python? Um, and spider as well. Anaconda is basically a Python distribution where you have many software tools that you can use to create your programs. And the spider is an IDE that is uh, used to create um, programs and write your code in it. And we can also run uh, our Python code uh, or our Python program in command prompt which is provided with Anaconda. So if you don't have the spider IDE, you can even then on your program using uh, the command prompt. So let's now get started. Uh, so here we are going to type S-P-Y-D-E-R which is uh, spider, the Anaconda IDE uh, where we have to write our programs. Uh, it is as I've already told you uh, a user interface for writing your program and it would take uh, a few seconds to uh, a minute or two uh, as soon as the spider IDE starts uh, loading. Uh, you can see this, um, it's initializing the libraries um, necessary to run uh, the IDE and uh, the speed of um, opening this interface is totally depends on um, the RAM you have, the space or the memory in your system and how fast actually your system is. So ID on the left side, the blue highlighted area. Here we will write our uh, first program for printing hello or hi. So print hello in double quotes and end you have a semicolon. Now you will save this file in uh, save as and after clicking the save as button uh, here is um, where you can save. I'm going to save it at a particular location and I am going to give uh, this first dot py. So uh, after that I'm going to select python files. Uh, I'm not going to go give PI, py just first and python files then it is going to be saved by the name of first dot py. This is the default extension that we use. So um, in order to run this file, uh, we have many options. For example, we can go to run and run, then this green uh, button, the play button or F5. As soon as you run the file on the right, that we have just written the code of printing hello on the left side and on the right side bottom you can see the highlighted area, the output of our program. Now you can also use command prompt CMD. And from CMD, we are going to select Anaconda prompt. From here also, we can run our program. So as soon as it is opened, it will take just a second or two to get loaded. As soon as it uh, gets loaded, we are simply going to type Python space, the name of our file was first, dot .py. So I'm going to type Python space, F-I-R-S-T first, dot .py, the name of our file. And I'm simply going to press the enter key. As soon as you press enter, you can see hello is printed. So what if you don't have uh, the Anaconda, uh, the spider interface actually. So uh, here we have the spider interface. We wrote our program. We click the run button and output was shown here. If you don't have this thing, you don't have to worry. You just have Python installed. You can simply write your uh, program in Notepad here in Notepad. I'm simply uh, going to uh, create a new file. Here I'm going to simply type the same code. Print in uh, brackets. I'm going to give uh, hello or hi or whatever I want to give for printing. And then I'm going to give a semicolon. Then I'm going to save this file. Now Now while saving this file, you have to now give here the name of the file as .py. In double quotes, we are going to give the name of file. Uh, for example, it is new .py and at the bottom save as type, we definitely have to select all files, .py and all files. If you don't select all files, it would be saved at, as notepad files. So here we are saving the .py file, the python file by selecting all files and giving new .py. Now we are going to return back to our uh, command prompt and we are simply going to type python space new dot py. So here what we have done is we have run our another 
program using only notepad if you don't have the idea of spider you can use this method as well to write your programs and to run them but of course the python uh, itself must be installed so these are um, the two ways that I've already told you of um, writing a Python program and running it. I hope it is helpful and you have to stay tuned for next videos where I'm going to teach you more about Python and its functions and a lot more.